All right, this is our 1998 Angola bus with the matching Angola trailer, stainless steel sides, an observation deck on the top, and that's the ladder to get up to it. It is a spare tire for the bus, electric lift for the trailer, so it's easy to hitch on and off. The rear of the bus, good paint, not any damage that's significant at all. You can see the observation deck up there. There's one as well on the bus. This is the engine access bay from the passenger side. The bus does not have bus air and heat. It has four roof air conditioners. Auxiliary heat and aqua hot heat. This is the auxiliary air compressor to level the bus while parked. The stainless steel is straight and without scratches. The first bay is water bay with sight glasses so you can see how much liquid is in the gray, the black, and the fresh water. It also has a faucet there for washing your hands and a quick dump for the fresh water bit, uh, tank. It has TV with two, two speakers. That gray stack there on the left is the six 8D batteries and the house switch for electricity. This tray is the ladder to get up to the observation deck. Without the observation deck, of course, it's additional storage. Additional storage here in a tray that goes clear across the bus. These are lead acid batteries, which we are replacing for the next owner. This bus is for sale. You can call Bob at 813-323-3006. You can see the Zip-D awning there for the patio awning. Again, continuing around the bus. The colors are bright and sharp, smooth. It has bus armor on the front. It keeps the stainless steel from being scratched, four air horns, and that remote spotlight up on top of the bus. It is there for parking and things like that. The fog lights, of course, docking lights, cornering lights. The first bay, of course, is the storage. The second one is the inverter space uh, with storage trays, drawers. The inverters are two 2,500-watt heart inverters. They work very well. The top drawer is a storage for uh, spare parts, filters, and so on, all those packages. And it has the belts. You need a spare set of belts for the bus while you're traveling. This bay is the generator. It's a Martin 17.5 diesel generator. Kubota engine, recently serviced. That black box on the right is the battery for the starter on this generator. Starts easily. It also has auto start and airbags to limit vibration. That small door there on the right is the fuel access door so it can be fueled from either side. The tanks, I believe, are 228 gallons or could be 268 gallons. 268 gallons. That's the aqua on the left. Full bus filter for the water, recoil uh, for the water hose fill, and the dump valves. These two exhaust tips are one for the aqua hot and one for the diesel generator. That silver uh, knob there is the Glendenning automatic electric reel in and out for the shore power. Continuing back along the trailer, you can see there's some damage on the lower uh, left hand side there at the bottom and some scratches that need to be painted right there like I said 
This bus is for sale. It's in very good condition. Fun to drive and very, very quiet. You'll like it, I know.